A disturbing trend at a park in Hillsborough County. Several men accused of exposing themselves and then soliciting sex. Our Clifton French joins us now live from the Sydney Dover Trails near State Road 60. And Cliff, this was happening when anyone, even a child, could just walk up, right? Yeah, you know, this park doesn't have any buildings. It's seven and a half miles of hiking and horse trails. And in some cases, these men are simply standing in the open committing sexual acts. It's a serene park, wooded trails, a lake, shaded picnic tables for families. Just yesterday, deputies say two men were using this park for sexual gratification on two different occasions. I'm working on a story about what's going on at the park in Dover. 35 year old Boyan Novakovic didn't want to talk about his arrest, but according to HCSO, an undercover deputy spotted him masturbating along the trail just before 11 yesterday morning. He even made contact with the deputy and eventually told him he, quote, wanted to see what it was like. Two hours later, 61 year old Randall Jones went a step further, approaching an undercover deputy near this lake asking for oral sex. It's a shame that something like that has happened out here. Ed and his wife Miriam walk the trails and say they hope this arrest keeps folks like that from coming back. They ought to do random checks of all the parks. The sheriff's office says that's exactly what they're doing, saying the problem goes further than this park. Not only these type of places in county parks or city parks, but even like in public restrooms and shopping malls, airports, um, bus stations. Tonight, the sheriff's office says you shouldn't be scared, but when enjoying a public place, always be vigilant. A lot of times they're used for these illegal um, deviant sexual activity. And this kind of behavior isn't new here either. I went back and checked the records. There have been four sex incidents at this park documented so far in the past year and a half. I'm reporting live in Dover tonight. Clifton French, ABC Action News.